Yeah, dude, what's that crazy secret you have to tell me? Bro, whatever you do, you gotta promise not to tell. Ha, I got your back, bro. I think I have a crush on my girlfriend's sister. Brittany? Ha, no way. Dude, if you tell anyone, you're dead me. Wait, hold on. I'm getting a call. Aw, oh, dude, it's Brenna. I gotta go. Hey, babe, what's up? Yo, I can't believe this. Oh my gosh, yes, I'm getting the high score. Way to go, sis. This is awesome. Woo, keep going. Oh my goodness, I can't believe it. I can't believe it. Wait, is that the time? Oh my goodness, no. What is it, Brenna? What's wrong? Oh my goodness, my boyfriend should be here any minute. I'm gonna be late. Wait, hold on. Man, I thought my sister and I were able to hang today. Well, looks like she's going on a date with her boyfriend. Brenna, wait, it, tell me about your date. Where are you guys going? I don't know, he said he was gonna surprise me, but Brent, I have to get ready. I don't wanna look crazy for my date. Can you get out of my room? I'm gonna change. Oh, yeah, yeah, sure, sorry. <laughs> I'm gonna go get a snack. I'm pretty hungry. I wonder what we got in the kitchen. Hmm. Oh, that must be Brenna's boyfriend. I'll go get the door. Hello? Oh my gosh. Hey, Brit, what's up? Uh, your hair looks really great today. Aw, thanks, Brad. I really appreciate it. Come on in. Did anyone ever tell you you look like you could be a famous YouTuber? Oh, that's really sweet, but uh, no, I haven't really heard that. And uh, oh, don't worry. My sister should be down any minute. She's just getting ready. Oh, okay, cool. Uh, do you happen to have a piece of paper? Uh, I think my mom has a notebook in the other room. I can go get it for you. Yeah, sure, that'd be great. Hold on one second. Here you go, Brad. Hey, thanks. Brad! Oh, uh, be right back. Coming, Brenna. What's up, sis? Oh my goodness, um, do you think I'm wearing too much makeup? I think just a little more blush. I think you look beautiful, and Brad's already here. Ah! Oh my gosh, why didn't you tell me that? Oh my goodness, I, I can't keep him waiting. I'm coming, Brad. Whoa, Brenna, you look amazing. Oh, <laughs> Well, you two have an amazing time on your date. I'll see you later. Bye, Britt. See you later, Britt. Wait, hold on, Brad. You, you left your piece of paper. Hey, dang it. I think I'm too late. Well, I'm not gonna lie. I'm a curious what he needed a piece of paper for. I'm gonna read it. Oh my gosh. It says, dear Brittany, I think you're the most beautiful thing I've ever seen in my life. I love you more than the stars in the moon. It's a love letter to me. What the heck? Does my sister's boyfriend have a crush on me? So Britt, what'd you do this weekend? Oh my gosh, you won't believe it. So my parents and I, we went to the zoo and- Oh, get out of the way! Oh my gosh! Oh, that's gonna leave a mark. Oh boy. So if it's gonna rain, let's get inside. Good idea, Britt. So you guys went to the zoo? Yeah, and oh my gosh, I watched this orangutan eat like 15 oranges. It was crazy. Huh. That does sound pretty crazy. And like a lot of stomach ache to me. <laughs> Thank goodness I'm not that orangutan. Oh, but something else really strange happened. Were you abducted by aliens? <laughs> what? No. Well, that makes one of us. So I think my sister's boyfriend has a crush on me. Ooh, love this. What intense drama. I don't know, Soph. I just don't know what to do. Well, uh, oh wait, hold on. Isn't that your sister down there? Oh yeah, that's them. I don't know, Britt. They look pretty in love to me. Well, yeah, so that's what I thought, but he wrote me a love letter. A love letter? What is this, 1954? Oh, seriously. What? Uh, quiet, they're coming this way. Hey, Britt. Oh, <laughs> hey, Brenna. Whoa, Britt, sick outfit. Uh, oh, this old thing? Um, uh, thanks, <laughs> yeah. Oh my gosh, we gotta get to class. I don't want detention. Oh yeah, babe. We have to go to the T-Swift concert tonight. Can't be late. Catch you later, Britt. Sophie, see, see, you said you liked my outfit. My dude, you are just being over dramatic. Just being nice. But if we really wanna prove he has a crush on you, we're gonna need more evidence. I mean, I don't know. Maybe I should just talk to my sister first. <laughs> That's a lame idea. So whatever. Oh no, right, second bell. We're gonna get in trouble. Ah, you're right. I can't afford to be late again. I don't want attention. I'm not gonna lie. I'm really nervous, but I have to talk to my sister. Maybe she can explain. Brenna. Hey, Brenna, are you in there? Yeah, Brett, come on in. Hey, sis, I really wanna talk to you. Oh, what's wrong? 
Well, um, I don't really know how to say this. Brit, come on. You can talk to me. We're sisters. What's bothering you? Okay, it's about your boyfriend. Oh my gosh, Brad! Ah, isn't he amazing? He's like the cutest guy in all of Roblox. And like, he just makes me melt. Ugh, I love him. I can't wait to get married one day. Uh, about that. I found this. Um, what is this? Brenna, Brad wrote that. What? <laughs> You're a liar. He would never do this. A love letter to you? Yeah, right. Honest, I'm telling you the truth. Seriously, Britt? You're probably the one who wrote this letter in the first place. What? No, why would I ever do that? I just can't believe you, Britt. This is so immature. You would stoop this low to try to ruin my happiness? What kind of sister are you? Brenna, no, don't get mad. I just wanted to tell you. Tell me a lie? You're so annoying, Brit. You're just jealous because you don't have a boyfriend like Brad. Now get lost. You're not welcome in my room anymore. Leave before I tell mom. Fine. Well, that didn't go according to plan. I have an order for Steve. Oh, well, yes, that is me. My cappuccino. Have a great day. Oh, I will now. This cappuccino's everything. Later. Oh, <laughs> hey, Brit. What's going on? Oh, hey, Brad. How's it going? It's great. I didn't know you worked here. Oh, yeah. I've been working here for about a year or so. It's an awesome job. And I love coffee. Wow. I really admire your dedication and the fact that you earn money all for yourself. Not gonna lie. It's kind of hot. Uh, anyway, <laughs> can I get you a coffee? A lemonade? Anything? Honestly, dealer's choice. I'm sure whatever you get is great, so I'll have one of those. Oh. Hey, um, our most popular drink right now is the lemon slush, so uh, I'll, I'll get you one of those. Psst, partner? Yeah, manager Mike, what's up? You need to be faster with customers, so that way there's not a line out the door. Oh, yeah, I'm sorry. I'm just trying my best. Well, hurry up! Time is money! Um, yeah, sure. Sorry. <laughs> Here's your lemon slush. This looks amazing. You're so efficient. That's awesome. Yeah. Thanks for the compliment. You know what? I'm gonna leave you a big tip. Hey, look, I need to talk to you. Ready? No flirting with the customers! Wait, heavy manager Mike! No, 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 um, that's not what I was doing. Trust me, I was not flirting with him. Uh, <clears throat> I'll catch you later, Britt. You weren't flirting, huh? <laughs> Likely story. This is your only warning. If you flirt with all the customers, you're gonna be fired! But manager Mike, that's not what was going on. That's my sister's boyfriend. <laughs> hear any excuses just get back to work the espresso machine needs a deep clean and i'm going on my break i want nachos okay we can lunch Ooh, oh my gosh what a long day at work i am so tired oh hey brenna brad i didn't know you guys were here oh hey brit what's up brad don't talk to her she's a liar babe what are you talking about Brit has a crush on you and tried to break us up isn't that right, Brit? What? No, I don't have a crush on him. <laughs> really? Get a load of this, Brad. She made some really poor plan to try to show me a love letter that you allegedly wrote to her confessing your love for her. Oh, uh, yeah, totally weird. Like, who does that? <laughs> Awkward. Yeah, Brit, who does that? Wait, seriously? Brenna, now you're the one that's lying. I can't believe you. Why are you acting this way? Hey, kids, um, what's the commotion? I heard yelling. Yeah, mom, Brett is trying to ruin my relationship. That's not true, mom, I'm not. Oh, dear, Brett, stop trying to ruin your sister's relationship and help me bring in the groceries. I've got to cook dinner, it is getting late. <laughs> Whatever, coming, mom. What the? Wait a sec. What's that noise? Is someone throwing something at my window? Down here. What the heck? <gasps> Brad? Seriously? What the heck is Brad doing? Weird. I'm gonna go talk to him. Doesn't he know that that's my bedroom window and not my sister's? Why is he holding flowers? What is going on? Brad, what are you doing? My sister's room is down there. No, <laughs> I wasn't looking for her. These are for you. What the? You brought me flowers? You know, Brett, I had no idea that you felt the same way about me. You have a crush on me. You like me. Um, what are you talking about? 
what Brenna said. You have a crush on me. And well, I like you too, if it's not obvious. Dude, what the heck? I can't accept these flowers. And I do not have a crush on you. Uh, okay, <laughs> maybe you're speaking in code. But we have to keep this a secret until I can find a way to break up with your sister. We have prom next month, so like, I already bought my tux, and uh, I don't really want to ruin anything. Dude, I am very sorry, but you have the wrong idea. I don't like you. Hey, who's out there? Oh no, it's your dad. Uh, I gotta go. Catch you later, Brit. Hey, is somebody back there? What's up, man? Brit! Ah! Dad, what are you doing out here? It's past curfew. Did you sleepwalk and take flowers from the neighbor's yard again? No, Dad, I didn't. Well, it is late. It is time for you to go to bed. Come on, get to your room. I don't this guys what am i supposed to do this is not good you brought me flowers this is totally getting out of hand what's up brit i'm here how's it going bestie <gasps> wait a second do i smell fresh flowers what what are these oh my gosh so that's exactly what i need to talk to you about dude about flowers brit i don't bore you with my axe collection so please have some respect and don't for me with a flower conversation. No, Sophie, you won't believe who they're from. My sister's boyfriend. <gasps> what? Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, tell me everything. Okay, well, where do we start? Um, He confessed his love to me and then he came over last night in the middle of the night, threw rocks in my window and gave me flowers. Oh girl, your sister's gonna hate you. Ooh. I know, Sophie. There is no way she's gonna believe any of this, especially now that she thinks that I'm the one who has a crush on her boyfriend. It's not that way, it's the other way around. Well, girlie, I don't know, maybe this could work in your favor. But how? Okay, I think I have an idea, but hold on one second, one second, let me just take these over here. First things first, we need to get rid of these flowers. Come on! Whoa, wait, Sophie, where are you going? Follow me! La, 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 la. And here we go, just a simple toss. Whoop. Much better. <laughs> now on to my plan. I'm so nervous, Sophie. Nah, don't worry, it'll be okay. I'll be hiding over there in the bushes, recording it all on my phone. But what if someone catches us? Nah, don't worry. Oh, I don't know, Sophie, I don't know. This feels crazy to me. Look, Brett, all we need to do is catch enough evidence that will for sure help convince your sister. Oh my gosh, Sophie, he's over there, he's over there. Um, uh, I'm gonna go sit, hide. Just act cool and collective and normal, Brit. Just be normal. <laughs> oh, hey, Brit, what's up? I'm so excited you finally came to your senses. Look, Brad, I really need to clear the air with you. Wait, wait, before you get started, I just want to tell you, I feel like you are the greatest human alive. Like it doesn't get any better than you. You're pretty, you're smart, you work really hard, and like, I don't know, just being around you has changed my life. Thanks. It's all really, really nice, but you are dating my sister. Well, I'm just dating your sister so I can get closer to you. That's not okay. I don't care. I'm in love. <laughs> what the heck? Sophie, hold on. Seriously? Where are you filming me? Uh, Give that to me. Now. Uh, Brett, Brett, help me out here. Uh, we can explain. Yo, seriously? No, this is not okay. I'm breaking your phone. No, buddy, don't, don't do it. Don't do it. Uh, dude, what the heck? That's my phone. I don't care. You're a creep. I'm out of here. Oh, that's it. Thanks for buying me a new phone, Brett. Honestly, so the least I can do after Brad ruined your old one. Yeah, you know, I loved that phone. I had so many pictures of my dog Lucky on there, and now they're gone. I just feel awful. I had no idea he would do that. Well, dude, he really caught feels for you. Kind of crazy. I know, and we've got to put an end to it, Soph. Well, maybe stop showering for a few weeks. I'm sure he'll stop liking you. Woo! You will smell, girl. Ew! What? No, definitely not. I am going to continue showering. Eh, well, live your life, I guess. <gasps> UDS. <clears throat> Excuse me? I have a delivery for Brittany. Uh, wait, what? Yeah, I got a package here for you. Whoa, just like Amazon. They can really deliver anywhere, huh? Who's it from? I don't know, said something about a secret admirer. Oh, um, uh, thanks, I think. Yep, have a great day. Oh my gosh, Brett. <gasps> you don't think...
think it's from Brad, do you? Wait, hold on. I didn't think of that. Probably, right? Oh, dude, it's most definitely from him. <laughs> oh, man. How are you going to explain this one? I don't know, Soph. I don't know what to do. You can start by opening the present. I want to see. I want to see. Open it, open it, open it. Jeez, wait, Sophie, Sophie, you're stressing me out. Open the gift, open the gift, open the gift. Wait a second. <gasps> what the heck is all of this? Oh my goodness. More presents? This is insanity. And it all says from your secret admirer? Oh no, 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 no. I think I know who it is and I don't want him to be sending me gifts. Britt, what the heck is all of this? Um, it's gifts from a secret admirer. <laughs> wow, Britt, <laughs> he must really have a crush on you. Brad, can we actually talk for a second? What, are you gonna try and steal my boyfriend, Britt? <laughs> Brenna, <laughs> there's no way she could do that. Whatever, you have 10 minutes. Did you do this, Brad? Yes, of course I did. I bought all your favorite things. I went to all your favorite stores. Everything you like, I bought it for you. Well, dude, this is not okay. You need to send it back. Never. I love you. Take your gift, dude. This has gone too far. What do you mean? No, no, no. You should have it. Brad, seriously? We just don't have to say anything to your sister, all right? Brad, where are you? Um, coming, babe. On my way. Oh my gosh, this is absolutely crazy. What am I gonna do with all these gifts? Gotta throw them out or something, or help donate them. I cannot accept this. Brad, are you liking the movie? Brad, oh my gosh, what the heck? Are you asleep? Oh, I love you, Brit. Oh my gosh, what the heck did you just say? Are you serious? Uh, huh? Uh, what? Oh, that's it! What'd I do? What'd I say? Uh, Brittany! Whoa, hey, what the heck is your problem? My boyfriend said he loved you in his sleep! What? You can't be serious. This is all your fault! No, I've done nothing wrong. Britt, I hate you. You are literally the worst sister in the entire world. How can you be mad at me? Your boyfriend's the one who has a crush on me. I didn't ask for this. You're a liar! Now stay away from my boyfriend or else I will never speak to you again in my life. You got that? I hate you, Brittany! You know what? That's it. I'm tired. I'm tired of trying to prove to my sister that I'm telling the truth. If she's not going to listen to me, then I just have to give up. And I'm just going to run away. Because I'm not going to stay in this house and have her yell at me. So I'm going to pack my things and never, ever come back. I can't believe this. I hate fighting with my sister. We're sisters. We're supposed to get along. But she won't believe me. So I'm out of here. Brittany? Dear, where do you think you're going? Mom, I'm running away to Sophie's. Oh, okay, have fun. Sophie. Hey, Brynn, what's going on, bestie? Well, Soph, I've ran away and I've come to live with you. Yay, oh my gosh, yes, I'm so excited, come on in, come on in. Thanks, Soph. Oh, don't mention it, bestie, but wait a minute, love to have you here, but why are you here? Well, I don't wanna deal with the drama of my sister anymore. I can't take it, bestie. Brynn? I'll let you stay the night, but in the morning, we're figuring this out. Because remember, we don't run away from our problems. We gotta solve this, okay? Now bring your things to my room and brush your teeth. I got some broccoli in there. Sophie, what the heck are you doing here? <laughs> You're coming with me, lady. What the? Hey, Sophie, put me down. What the heck, Sophie? All right, here you are. Now you two talk. No, I'm not going to talk to you. There's no way I'm talking to you, loser. Come on, Brenna, please. I beg you. Mm, nope, not happening. Nope, don't make me get my axe, Sheila, because I will. I will. Chase, the way is fine. What is it, Brett? What do you want? Look, I know you think I'm lying about your boyfriend having a crush on me, but just give me like five minutes to show you I'm telling you the truth. Give me a chance. No, why should I? Because we're sisters and I would never do anything to hurt you. Just let Brit show you that your boyfriend's a creep. And if you still don't believe her after this, well, you can run Brit out of town. Fine, you've got a deal. Oh, I hope he shows up. I hope he shows up. I'm so nervous. Oh, I hate waiting. 
Hey, Brit! <laughs> there you are. So happy to see you. You know, Brad, I really need to confess something to you. Oh yeah? What is it? Well, I, I don't know how to say this, but uh, I think I'm in love with you. Oh my gosh, amazing! Oh, it's the best news ever. Oh, I love you too. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. That's it! So it's true! You really love her, don't you? Uh, um, uh, I can explain. No, we're over. Get out of here, you loser! No, please, Brenna. Come on, prom's next week, and uh, I already bought my tux. Nobody! That's the end of you. You heard the lady! Get lost! Oh my goodness! Well, I still love you, Brenna! I'm in love! Bro! Bro! You go first. Nah, you go first. She's like the prettiest girl in the whole world. And that's how we'll solve global warming. She is so smart. I'm gonna marry her. My turn. We're over. Bye! So I thought I'd never find love again until... La 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 la. Whoa, I think I'm in love. Wait a minute. Yeah, hold up. Are we in love with the same girl? Ah! Running late for school again? Why does this always happen, people? Wait a minute, what the heck? Someone seriously put flowers at my locker? Do you like them? <laughs> Who are you? Oh, actually, you're the new kid in my class. Ryan, right? Did you get these for me? Of course I did. You wanna be my girlfriend? We're meant to be, you know. Oh, I'm sorry, Um, I don't really know you. <gasps> oh gosh, no, this is awful. I'm gonna be really, really late to class. Excuse me, what are you two doing? Class started by five seconds. Oh gosh, it's Henry the Hall Monitor. Oh, I'm, I'm going to class, bye! <laughs> just playing hard to get, huh? She's gonna fall in love with me. I just know it. You know, Cindy, I really hope we get customers in here soon. The workday will go by so slow if no one comes in. Uh, Britt, do you know that guy? He's been staring at you for an hour now. What? Oh yeah, that's a new boy at school. I think he has a crush on me. Do you want me to tell him to get lost? Take him out? You know what, if you don't mind, I'm actually gonna go talk to him real quick. Hey, look, I already told you thanks, but no thanks. I really don't want to be your girlfriend. Yeah, but like roses are red, my jacket's blue, you're really cool, and I think I love you too. Come on, a day would be great. Right, wouldn't it? We could be like two peas in a pod. <laughs> yeah, look, that's really sweet and all, but no thanks. I'm all set. But you gotta get going. You can't be creeping around my workplace. I never wanna leave your side. You're amazing. Oh boy. Okay, I'm really flattered and all. Okay, buddy. It's time for you to get going. Stop hanging out side of our store. <laughs> well, all right. Don't worry, my queen. We shall see each other soon. I'll be dreaming of you. Oh, my goodness. What a weirdo. Come on, Soph, you got this. Oh, 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 my pineapple, Sophie. Where did you go? That was crazy. Girl, what over here? Oh, my goodness. That was exhilarating. It launched me the next week. Oh, my gosh, you could say that again. Well, girl, and since we're camping, it's time for some mores. Come on. Oh, I'm excited. Let's eat. Nothing says camping quite like a s'more, am I right? It's true, Soph, and I'm so excited to spend time with you. The past few days have been a little weird. You see, this new guy at school has been like totally obsessed with me, and it's really, really strange. Oh my gosh. Hey, Brad, I, I can make you an awesome s'more. I know you love them. <laughs> oh my gosh. What the heck? Dude, what are you doing here? Buddy, you are crashing a girl's trip. Well, I, I just wanted to spend time with you and hang out, you know? Look, I don't want to be rude, but I I really don't get why you can't take a hint. I don't want to be your girlfriend. So come on, let's go in the cabin. Yeah, this dude smells like a weirdo. Ugh, was that cologne? Uh, I'll catch you later, okay? Bye. Wait, Brittany, hold up. Uh, come back. See, so that was the guy I was talking about. Weird, huh? Uh, no, what's weird is that sound. Do you hear that? Where is it coming from? Oh, no, you don't think this cabin is haunted. Hey, Britt. Oh, my gosh. What in the world? I thought you were just outside. Yeah, dude. How did you get into the cabin? Hey, Britt. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. No. Wait. Or I, I, I've got to be seeing things. Hold the phone. There are two of you. Oh my gosh, Sophie, uh, apparently so. Dude, what are you doing here? I'm here to take her on a date. Nah, bro, I'm here to take her on our first date. Step back. Uh, Brett, you thinking what I'm thinking? Yo, dude, you don't even know her like I do. Well, yeah, right, I know her way more than you. That's not true. Yeah, Sophie, let's end this girl's trip early and get out of here. Right back. Ryan, you ruined it. She hates you. No, I didn't, bro. She likes me more than you. Yeah, right. No, she doesn't. Well, let's just ask.
ask her who she likes more. We all know it's gonna be me. You missed one day your school, it's unacceptable! I'm really sorry, Mr. Jackson, but I was on a girl's trip. Must be nice, I wish I could take a girl's trip whenever I wanted, but I can't! Just take your homework and missed assignments and get out! Okay, I I'm sorry again, have a good night, <laughs> bye! So mad and wait a minute. What the heck is going on? Yeah, right, dude. No, you're not talking to her first. I already claimed it. Well, I'm cooler. I'm gonna talk to her first. What don't you get? Yo, bro, do we like have a problem or something? Um, what the heck are you two talking about? Brit, oh my gosh, there you are. Okay, so you have to tell us who do you like more? It's obviously me, right? <laughs> Look, guys, I'm sorry. I'm just really not interested in dating either of you. You seem like very very nice guys, but I don't love either of you. <laughs> yeah, but like, I'm much more handsome. Yeah, dude, but I'm the rich twin. I got all the money. Bro, seriously? Yeah, seriously. I'm telling the truth. No, you're not. You're lying. Shut up, man. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, look, you two are brothers. You shouldn't be fighting. We're not gonna stop until you pick one of us. So who's it gonna be? Yeah, Britt, who's the better twin? You can be honest. It's definitely me. No, bro, it's me. I don't I really know what to tell you two. I'm not choosing either of you. Maybe we can just be friends. And I, uh, just gonna get on out of here. Beep, beep, sorry. <laughs> Have a great day. <laughs> All right, I am out of here. Goodness, those two are crazy. She has to like us. I mean, we're like the coolest guys in town. Yeah, obviously. I mean, I'm a little cooler, but whatever. <laughs> Shut up, man. I think she's just testing us. Yeah, maybe you're right. She'll fall for one of us eventually. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm gonna win her heart. Just you wait and see. Yeah, whatever, man. Wait a second. This is wicked weird. What is wrong with my house? The front door's open and like almost all the lights look off. This is so strange. I hope no one broke in. Hello? Hello? Why are all these lights off? Is anybody home? Oh, Brit, hey, babe. You're home. Welcome home. <gasps> oh, gosh. What the heck? What are you doing in my house? Nothing can stop me from falling in love with you. <laughs> Definitely not a door. <laughs> okay, and wait a minute. What is this? This looks like a very very romantic dinner. Yeah, it's a table for two. Me and you. Okay, this is way too much. You literally broke into my house and then made me a romantic dinner? Yeah, isn't it like real romantic? Reflects how much I love you. I am not your girlfriend for the millionth time. What the heck? We gotta clean all this up. Oh, come on, don't be like this. I know you like me more than Brian. Dude, I told you I don't like either of you in that way. Now, can you please get out of my house? <laughs> You're so funny, Brit. You're always making me laugh. You're the best girlfriend ever. <laughs> hey, wait a minute. Um, don't take a seat, dude. Hello, you need to leave or else I'm calling the cops, okay? So, Brit, uh, what type of wedding do you see yourself having? Like a beach or do you want like pets? And I'm not telling you any of this. We're not dating. Yeah, but like, what's your favorite color and your favorite holiday and all those things? I need to know about that. Oh, for the millionth time, we are not on a date, dude. It's gotta be home. Hey, Zach. Zach, are you here? Hey, Britt, what's up? Who's that in her house? Whoa, 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 wait a minute. Britt, who is this? I'm her older brother. Who are you? This is Ryan. He broke into our house and he's trying to make me date him. Yo, you messed with my sister. Get out of the house, dude. Or what? Oh, you're gonna win. You never said that. Whoa, oh my gosh, older brother. How are we ever gonna be in laws? Yeah, man, get out and stay out. Leave my sister alone, loser. Oh my gosh, Brenda, I'm actually having a really, really great day with you. It's fun to spend time with my sister. Ew, Brett, don't ruin it. I'm getting a little thirsty, so we should probably grab a coffee. You're on thin ice, lady. Thin ice. Hey there, my love. I've missed you. Ew, Brett, are you dating this nerd? No, definitely not. <laughs> That's what I like about you. Here you're always just so funny. Okay, what do you want? Well, I want to give you this sports car. <laughs> and I was thinking, uh, maybe $500,000 is all for you as a token of my appreciation. What? You want to give all this to me? Are you serious? What? That's not fair. I want it. Honestly, Brenda, you can have it. I don't want anything to do with this. I'm certainly not taking it. Well, Britt, if you won't take my presents, then will you please go on a date with me? I'm sorry. You and your twin brother seem like really nice guys, but I I'm just not interested, and you can't quite take a hint, so I don't really know what else to say, but no. And this is insanity. I'm taking this then. You snooze, you lose. Hey, wait, what? No! What the heck? That's not yours! Later, losers!
Girl, are you serious? They did that? Yes, and honestly, I have no idea how I'm gonna get them to stop, too. Dude, you just gotta ignore them. They'll forget about you eventually. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. Maybe? Maybe not. But honestly, Soph, I don't really think that will be anytime soon. Achoo! Don't shut up! Hold on, are you too serious? Honestly, what the heck? How long have they been standing there? Hey, Britt, no, we're real sad you're not dating one of us. I mean, look at me. Yeah, but look at me. I'm the stronger twin. I'm the more fashionable twin. All right, look, you two. My bestie is saying she doesn't want to date you two. Then get lost. Yeah, guys, I'm sorry, but all this doesn't really impress me. Seriously? What the heck? Yeah, come on. Whoa, girl, they like you a lot. It doesn't matter, Soph. Like I told you, I am not dating you two. Have you guys heard the lady? Yeah, whatever. You just need time to think about it. Yeah, it's true. Bye, Britt. Yeah, bye. We love you. Girl, this is wild. I know. And honestly, I don't know how much more I can take. I feel like I am going crazy here. And girl, you seem a little stressed out. How about you come over to my house this weekend for a sleepover? And I'll be fine. All right, Eduardo. I need to figure out what I need to get me and Britt for the sleepover. I already got you everything you needed. You got your pizza. You got your root beer float. And my bestie deserves some good snacks. She has been stressed out. I already have two pork chops. I'm coming. Ah, what the heck? What do you want? <laughs> get her. Oh, what the? Uh, yes, sleepover time. Sophie, I'm here. Oh, bestie, open up. Oh, hey, Britt. You're not Sophie. What are you doing in my best friend's house? Why don't you come in? We got some pizza. Where is it? Oh, oh my gosh. Both of you are here? What the heck? Where is my best friend? What did you do to her? Ready? Ready? I'm in here. Let me out. Let me out. Uh, did you lock her in her room? You should know Sophie is claustrophobic. What the heck is wrong with you? There you are, girl. Oh, my goodness. I was so wetting. I'm glad to see you, Britt. Let me at these jerks, you two bozos. Yo, relax. Don't you tell me to relax, buddy. Sophie, it's okay. I can handle this. What exactly were you two thinking? Well, uh, we locked her in her room until she would tell us something about you. Yeah, we figured your best friend knew all your secrets and she would know how we could become your boyfriend. Oh, I'm gonna tell you two something right now. You two are crazy. Well, all right, all right. We're sorry. Yo, dude, we should probably get out of here. Yes, you should. Oh, uh, yeah, bro. L let's get out of here. Taking the pork chop, though. Ha <laughs> ha. Uh, see ya. Oh my goodness. Thank gosh they're gone. I know, girl. Oh, they keep following you everywhere. They're gonna be in some deep trouble. Well, it doesn't seem like they're stopping anytime soon, and I've run out of ideas. I'm taking you out of town for safety, and I know the perfect spot. To my secret life! Where in the world is Sophie? She said she would be here. She made it very clear I had to meet her at her military base. And the girl is late. Hey, Britt! What's up, girl? Oh, my gosh. Sophie, when in tarnation did you get yourself a tank? I figured it was time to bring out the big guns. <laughs> Soph, don't you think this is a little bit overboard? I don't know. Maybe you can never be too safe. But honestly, my ax Sheila is really all we need. Come on. Let's go inside. All right, girl. Right behind you. Um, Sophie, what the heck is that sound? Oh, no. This is not good. For the security cams! What? Okay. All right, let's see here. <laughs> Perfect, bro. Good job. Come on. Oh, my gosh. There's no way they can break in here. They broke in. Break, this isn't good. This isn't good. What the heck? No, Sophie, this is a nightmare. You literally just told me to be super safe here. That's it. I'm on them. Wait. Sophie, hold up. Don't hurt him too much. You two freaks. Get off my property. Oh, gosh. Sophie. Watch this, Brett. <laughs> <laughs> you two are no match for me. Y'all, this is crazy. How did you two even find me? We hacked your phone and put a tracker on it. You did what? We're sorry, Brit. Yeah, we're, we're real sorry. You're just so pretty and awesome, and we wanted to date you. Yeah, that's all we wanted. Look, guys, I'm sorry you're so upset, but you need to promise you're gonna stop following me. It's over. Yeah, I mean, I guess. I don't know how I'll live without you, but I'll try. <laughs> we'll get out of here. We'll leave you alone. Come on, you two. Chop, chop, get moving. Whoa. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh, yeah. We're out. I said get out and get away from my friends. 
Yo, this is crazy. Yeah, man, totally. Look, bro, I can't believe you let that just happen. You're ruining everything. It's all your fault. Bro, you're hurting my feelings. Do you even care? I love Brittany. And you've been saying I'm a jerk. Well, maybe if you weren't such a jerk, I wouldn't say these things to you. Dude, you have no idea what you're talking about. You know what, man? I wish we were never even brothers. And you're ruining my life. You don't mean that, do you? Wouldn't say it if I didn't mean it, loser. Ooh. What the heck, bro? That's messed up. I'm out of here. You don't want me as a brother. You'll never have to see me again. Dude, wait up. You know, I was thinking of asking Tina about maybe trying out for that management role. What do you think? <gasps> wait a minute. That's it. What, what is it? All right, creep show. We can see you. What the heck, Ryan? Are you seriously stalking me again? No, um, I actually am looking for Brian. Hold on. There's two of these people? That's two too many. Why are you asking me where your brother is? You're twins. Don't you have, like, that telepathy, like, connection thing? Uh, this isn't good. Um, excuse me, sir. You're making a disturbance in the store. Can you please leave? Uh, fine, I'll go. And don't come back, okay? Look, I I'm gonna go talk to him. I'll be right back. Ryan, hey, what is going on? Are you okay? No, I'm not okay. My best friend and my twin brother ran away. What? Well, this town isn't too big. I'm sure we can find him if you look. No, I feel like he's in trouble. I have to find him. My senses are telling me something is not good. Okay, okay. Well, let's think here. I want to help you, but you see, I'm worried. Is this a trick? I'm not going to fall for this. No, Britt, I promise it's not a trick. I could really use your help. Okay, I'm going to go tell her that I have to clock out early and we can start looking for your brother. Yeah, no, absolutely not. There's not enough time. Come on, let's go. Just put me down. What the heck? What are you doing? You have have to look everywhere, okay? And remember, he looks just like me. Yeah, yeah, I know. I got it. All right, cool. Let's split up. I'm gonna go towards the farm, and I'm gonna try my luck at the airport, okay? Good luck. Bye, Brit. Thanks. Now go find my brother. Let's go see if he's at the airport. Excuse me, um, sir? I was wondering if you could help me. I don't know nothing about missing luggage, lady, okay? Get lost. No, I'm not looking for luggage. I'm looking for someone. He has like a, a mohawk and like a letterman jacket. Look, lady, a thousand people a day walk through here. You think I remember everyone? How am I supposed to? <gasps> Over there. Looks like him. But he's in a disguise? Oh my gosh, Brian, I'm so glad to see you. Uh, I don't know who you're talking about or what you're talking about. Uh, that is not my name. Dude, come on. Seriously, I know it's you. You're just in a really awful disguise right now. <laughs> hey, I love this. Kind of want a mustache. Uh, well, I think we should get back together. <laughs> I've missed you. What? Ew. No, we're not getting back together. I'm here to get you because your brother really misses you. Yo, my brother's a bozo. He has been looking for you for days. Wait, really? He has? Oh man, I didn't know he cared. Like, at all. <laughs> Look, Brian, I'm gonna bring you back home. So get your bags or whatever it is you brought here to the airport with you and come on, let's go. Your brother should be right over here. And wait a minute. Oh my gosh. What is going on over here? Yo, help. What the heck? I don't know how to ride this thing. This horse is wild. Oh my gosh. Uh, they're there. Hey, a horse. Are you down? Whoa. Oh man, that hurt. Yo, dude, you look so dumb right now. Brittany, you found Brian? I can't believe this. I know, right? And honestly, I think you two have something you probably need to say to each other. Yeah, man. Yeah, dude, I've been thinking we should never, ever let another girl come between us. Yeah, I mean, we're family. That shouldn't happen. Pretty dumb to fight. Yeah, man. Especially over a girl. What in tarnation? You two stay away from my horse. Oh, my gosh. You are so beautiful. I think I'm in love. We should go on a date. Yo, bro, absolutely not. She's going on a date with me. What, are you serious? You know what, these two are weirdos. I'm gonna get out of here and let them do their twin fighting thing. Good luck, cowgirl. <laughs> You're gonna need it. No one is here to help you now. How? That's what you think. It's blue lightning. You think you can stop me? Of course I can. Take this. Oh. Thanks again, blue lightning. Now take care of this villain. She's the most beautiful girl I've ever seen. You have a crush on her. <laughs> She'll never be with a super loser like you. I've had enough of you. Take this. You're really held hostage by the super villain. I know, right? It was wild and crazy. If I had been there, I would have
taught that villain a lesson or two. Yeah, <laughs> that's true, Sophie. But I'm so glad that Blue Lightning was there to save me. He came just in time. He's the coolest, best superhero in the world. Did somebody say they needed a hero? Blue Lightning, we were just talking about you. Hello there, it's you again. It's a... Uh... Really great to see you. Can I help you in any way? This time, we're actually all set. Thanks for saving my bestie. Yeah, I can't thank you enough. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Don't mention it. I uh, was just only doing my job. Well, dude, you better keep it up. This town has been going downhill ever since all those supervillains and bad guys started showing up. I mean, my bestie over here was attacked. I promise that I'll protect Brittany no matter what. Uh, just Brittany? Ooh, what about me? <laughs> Help, help! A citizen in need. Let's go see him in action. Come on. Somebody help me. I'll save you, citizen. I'll be right there. Let's get you back to safety. Thank you, Blue Lightning. You saved Harvey. You bet I did. Thanks. Bye. Did you see that? That was awesome. Great job, Blue Lightning. You did it again. That was nothing. <laughs> you two be safe. I got to get out of here. Hopefully, I'll see you soon. Is this just me? Or does Blue Lightning have a crush on you? No, there's no way, Sophie. Now, come on, we gotta get back to the salon. What a long day at work. I am so ready to go home. Hey, you! <gasps> Jeez, Steve, what do you want? I want you to hand over all your money now! I don't have any money. Now get lost. I'll go, but first, you're gonna have to try and catch me. Hey, that's my car! Somebody please help! My car was stolen! Stop right there! Blue lightning! Give this beautiful lady her car back! I'm out of here! And I'll throw you in jail if you ever get near her again! Brittany, are you okay? He didn't harm you, did he? I'm totally fine, but thank you for getting my car back. You really saved me, again! It, it was nothing, really. You look really pretty today. Oh, you think? I mean, you saw me just a few hours ago. I gotta ask, um, do you, I don't know, have a crush on me or something? Well, yeah, I have the biggest crush on you. Would you maybe want to go on a date with me? Yeah, sure. <laughs> a date sounds great. Awesome, I I'm so excited, yeah. Well, I'll pick you up tomorrow at seven. I'll catch you later, Britt. I can't believe it. Am I really going on a date with a superhero tomorrow? My best friend is going on a date. So, ugh, enough making fun of me. It's just a date. I don't see what the big deal is here. You're going on a date with a superhero. I definitely want a new fit for our date. So I'm really glad you're here to help me pick out an outfit. Yeah, girl, that's what besties do. Now come on. Ew. What are you two doing here? Um, we're here to shop. Uh, we're at a clothing store. And besides, Brittany's got a date. Seriously? You have a date? You of all people? You're such a loser. All right, Melissa, if you say one more thing, I'm gonna bop you right in your dumb face. I'm outie. Good luck on your date, Brittany. You're gonna need it. Now that she's finally gone, we can focus on what we came here for. Some shopping. Well, girl, let's just grab a bunch of things and have you try them on. I'll head to the fitting room. What do you think? Next. What about this? You look like a farmer. What about this? Change. Yes, it's perfect. No, so I think this is it. You look awesome. Time for your date. I'm so nervous. This date will be wonderful. <laughs> yeah, you got this, buddy. <laughs> no, I'm going to be late. I got to get out of here. What is Blue Lightning up to? Man, what is taking Blue Lightning so long? I mean, doesn't he have super speed or something? Brittany, Brittany! You made it. Hey, what's up? I'm so sorry I was late. On my way over here, I saw this little kitten. It was stuck in a tree, and uh, yeah, it wasn't because I was nervous at all. Nope. <laughs> well, I'm glad you're here now. Come on, let's go inside. I'm wicked thirsty. Hey, Cafe Manager Mike, what's up? Yeah, is that Blue Lightning? Hey, man, that's me. What's up? Um, can I get an autograph? A picture? Something? Yeah, man, uh, maybe later. Well, why don't you two take a seat? Whatever you need's on the house. I have some special pigs in a blanket that are just in the oven. Let me go get them. Works for me. All right, um, I don't know. Want to maybe sit... Here? This is perfect. Um, what's your favorite thing to do? I like to save people. Cool, 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 cool. Um, are you a cat person, a dog person? Dogs, of course. They're the best animal in the whole world. I love 
love a dog because they make me so happy. You know what else makes me happy? Ice coffee. Speaking of which, where did Mike go? He'll be out in a second, or I hope. Ah! Ah! It sounds like somebody's in trouble. I need to investigate. It sounds like it came from the kitchen. Should we go in? I don't believe it. Blue lightning. What are you doing out of prison? The door was left wide open. I can do anything I want. Wait a minute, is that your date? Wow, what a nerd. <laughs> Brittany, you might want to be careful. Why would you say that? Dating a nerd like Blue Lightning is a bad move. You should date someone cool like me. Victor the villain. Ew, yeah, no, no thank you. Oh, that's it. I'm gonna take over Bloxburg and destroy Blue Lightning once and for all. And that really hurt my feelings, okay? I'm really sorry for this, Brittany, but uh, I need to chase after Victor. You're right, and honestly, I should probably help Mike over here. Thank you for understanding. So much for our date. Wait, he seriously asked you out? What a creep! Hold on, so... Did you leave my front door open? What do you think, I'm some kind of animal? I snuck in through the kitchen window. That's what normal people do. Do you think someone broke in? Only way to know is to find out, come on. Shady Steve, what are you doing? I was looking for something valuable. Get out, Steve, what is wrong with you? Oh, come on, I was just taking a look. Get out of my house, dude. Ah, get out of my house and don't come back. Uh... I told you not to mess with Brittany ever again. That really hurt. I'm out of here. Britt, are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Way to go, dude. Too bad you couldn't have saved the date that you ruined. Oh, I didn't mean to ruin the date. Don't listen to Sophie. It was no problem at all. I understand. You're a superhero. You have things you have to do. You're, uh, your friend Sophie's right. The only reason why supervillain Victor was there was because of me in the first place. Would you maybe want to go out again? Yeah, of course. Maybe Maybe we can do something a little bit more low-key. I didn't know what flavor you liked, so I, I bought them all. Oh, blue lightning. That's so sweet of you. Strawberry looks really good. I'll take that one. You know, this really is a great idea. And I promise, no more distractions on our date. Come on, how about we go for a walk in the park? Sounds splendid. Help, help. A man fell in the river. I can't swim. Oh, thank you, blue lightning. No problem, sir. Brittany, I'm, I'm so sorry. Blue Lightning, you don't have to say you're sorry. I mean, that man was stuck in the river. You had to save him. Maybe we should head back to the pier. It didn't look like many people were over there by the Ferris wheel. Yeah, that's a great idea. And maybe I could grab a second on ice cream. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's so funny. Seriously? Yeah, I mean, that's what they tell us at a uh, superhero school. <laughs> Crazy, huh? Well, look, Blue Lightning, I'm really having a fun time with you. This has been a great day. I've had an incredible time with you, Brittany. Help, help, oh my gosh. Oh no, 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 I, I, I can't, I, I'm ignoring it. No, no, nobody needs my help. Lightning, I don't know. No, Brittany, I, I promised you. I'm afraid to hide, somebody please help me. And I smell bad too, it's awful. I think someone's on top of the Ferris wheel. No, Brittany, I, I told you, uh, no more distractions from our date. I think this is important, Blue Lightning. That guy's terrified up there, and I'm terrified just looking at him. I don't want you to think I'm ignoring you. Go help that man. He needs you. I'm coming, citizen. Here you go, little buddy. Safe and sound. Thank you, Blue Lightning. And your sidekick. No, I I'm not a sidekick. I'm just on a date with him. He saved two people while you were on your date. Excuse me. Oh, man. You are not paying enough attention to me. I need a new haircut. You get the same cut every week, and I already told you I was done. Now, can you please go home? I'll see you next week, Sophie. You better pay attention to me. Tell me more about this day. Honestly, that was kind of it. I'm just so excited because we actually made plans to go catch a movie later this weekend. A second date? Did I hear you say you're going on a second date? Well, of course Britt is going on another date. It's technically her third date. The first 
ended in tragedy. Well, not really tragedy, but it wasn't really a good date. Sophie, you don't need to be telling everyone this. What did you do, Britt? I bet something so stupid and embarrassing. That's not it at all. And mind your business, Melissa. Everything's my business. Well then, for your information, I'm dating a superhero, and he had to quit our date early to go save me from a supervillain. Why would a superhero date you? Especially when I'm single and available. Dude, no one's dating you because you probably have the worst attitude in the entire world. Your personality is trash. Well, enjoy your date with a superhero while it lasts, Brittany. I'm sure he'll get sick of you and, and dump you because you're you're you and I'm me and I'm out of here. Ah! Do you think we can permanently ban that girl from the salon? I don't get it. What does Blue Lightning see in her anyways? I want Blue Lightning all to myself. I'm gonna break Brittany and Blue Lightning up. <laughs> So nice and quiet out here. I'm a little nervous being really far away from the city. What if supervillain Victor attacks again? Or, or someone needs my help? Relax, Blue Lightning, come on. I mean, even superheroes need a day off every once in a while. We have police officers and good Samaritans out there that can help while you're away. I guess, I mean, I've just never really relaxed before. Well, don't worry, it'll be easy. So first thing you have to do while around a campfire is, well, uh, make some s'mores. What's that? Oh my goodness, let me explain. Yeah, they help! Someone needs my help all the way out here? No, I know that voice from anywhere. I think it was coming from the parking lot. Let me go look. Oh, lightning. <laughs> I'm so glad you're here to help me. Is everything okay? Blue lightning, of course she's okay. There's nothing wrong with her. What are you even doing out in the woods anyway, Melissa? Aren't you like allergic to nature or something? I thought the mall was out here and I got totally lost and now I'm scared. Wait a minute, you thought the mall was out here? That, <laughs> that's odd. You seem fine to me. Oh my gosh, well I'm only fine now because you're here. You're my hero. You saved me, Blue Lightning. It, it was uh, no trouble at all. Uh, Britt, why don't you say I uh, call her an Uber to pick her up and take her to the mall? Oh my gosh, Blue Lightning, that would be so amazing. Well, I'll be right back. There's no service up here. I'm gonna run to the road. <laughs> this is a working job. Just the way I wanted it to. I knew you were up to something, Melissa. I'm here to take the spotlight and ruin your date. And most importantly, steal your boyfriend. Well, you can try all you want, Melissa, but it's not gonna work. And besides, he has a crush on me and not you. Bad news is I couldn't call you an Uber. Melissa, if you want, I can take you to town myself. Besides, it's faster. There's no need for you to worry about her. Look, she's perfectly fine. She can walk herself back to town. No, I, I can't walk. I'm so disoriented and tired. Can you fly me back home? Yeah, uh, of course. I, I don't mind helping you. Sorry, Britt. I'll, I'll call you later, okay? Oh my gosh, Blue Lightning, you really are a hero. <laughs> well, at least I have some s'mores I can make. Well, here you are. Blue Lightning, like you are so amazing and so handsome. I had no idea superheroes could look as cute as you. That's really kind of you to say, but uh, you know, I'm dating someone, so I'm not really interested in you. How could you not be interested in me? I'm way prettier than Britney and I'm more rich and popular. I'm really sorry, this is super awkward. Uh, good luck, I hope you get home safely. I hate Blue Lightning. Did somebody say they hate blue lightning? Who are you? I can sense you're angry and negative, and I want to help you. All right, so two orders of very buttery popcorn coming right up for the movie. Look at that. It looks like pure gold. A girl, I need you to dish. What is going on with you and blue lightning? Hold on, let me put this down. Girl, honestly, things could be going a lot better if millionaire Melissa minded her own business and didn't try to break us up. Next time I see her, mm -mm -mm, she's in big trouble. Why haven't you dated anyone lately? Most boys just can't keep up with me. It's weird. Did you order pizza again? Uh, I don't know, maybe. I'll go look. I'll be right back. Oh, Melissa, what do you want? I'm here to apologize, you know, about earlier when I ruined your date. This does not seem real. I feel awful. Break, 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 big problem! That's Sophie, Sophie, Sophie! Get out of here! And you leave my best friend alone! I have no issue with your best friend here. Oh yeah, you're gonna have an issue when I try to beat you up, buddy! Who 
Quiet down. What do you do that for? Like I said, I'm not worried about your little friend here. I know that you're dating Blue Lightning, and I'm gonna ruin his life by stealing you. I'm out of here and- ah! Going somewhere? Melissa, get out of my way! Uh, you're coming with me. Let me out! You're just so annoying. I don't even understand what Blue Lightning sees in you. Well, it doesn't matter because he's gonna come and save me, you know? You think so? <laughs> he's never found my base before, so he's never gonna find it now. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have some villain business to take care of. I gotta find a way out. I need to free myself. Come to think of it, Sophie taught me how to pick a lock. Here we go. Just a little wiggle, something like that, and yes! I'm free, but now I gotta sneak out. Picture the villains over there. What is he even doing? I'm gonna ruin Bloxburg. Maybe if I buy a llama, that will throw the people off. Wait, seriously, he's gonna order a llama? Well, now is my chance to sneak out. Hopefully he doesn't hear. Perfect, okay, here we go, la la, and <gasps> oh, it's you! And what exactly do you think you're doing? Step aside, Melissa. I'm sneaking out of here. Oh, Victor! Missing something? How did you get out? I told you to keep her locked up. I hired you to help me. Now help me! So, Melissa, you're behind all of this? Of course I am. Now, Victor, see to it that she is locked away forever. Why are you working with the supervillain anyway? I want your boyfriend to be my boyfriend, not yours. You need to get better insults. Quiet down, you freak. I'm gonna tell Blue Lightning the truth, that you moved away because you hate him and think he's a weak superhero. Then I can save the day and date the hero. Well, he's not gonna believe you, because he knows the truth. I'm gonna save the day and save his broken little heart. Can I come with you to see him cry? Well, of course you can. Well, let's get out of here. You're gonna tell him a total lie and he's gonna be really upset. Somebody, if you're out there, please help me. What was that? Did someone say help? Blue Lightning, you're here. How did you find me? When Sophie told me Victor took you, I knew exactly where his secret base was. Now let me get you out of there. Thank you. Now let's get moving. This place gives me the creeps. Uh, yeah, you can totally say that again. Come on. But before we go, I'm gonna destroy his computer. You know, as a little revenge. Ha! Huh. I know I keep saying this, but thank you again for saving me. It's no problem at all. Uh, I'm just starting to feel really bad. I keep putting you in danger. I mean, you can't exactly control what supervillain Victor is doing, and he's not working alone anymore. He has a little sidekick now. He does? But who? Oh, hello. Look at these losers. What is going on? You two leave my house right this instant. Not until Blue Lightning breaks up with you and dates me. Melissa, you're an awful person. I would never date you. You're selfish, rude, and boring, honestly. I'm not boring. You just, you don't understand me. Nobody understands me. <laughs> I thought I would never get rid of her. Oh, now back to real business. Take this. Maybe next I should drop you in a vat of chemicals or control your mind. That is, if you don't surrender, Blue Lightning. I've had enough. I surrender. Blue Lightning, you can't. I knew you'd cave. The only way I'll surrender is if you promise that you'll leave Brittany alone forever. That should be simple enough. Blue Lightning, you know he is evil. He's not gonna leave me alone. I'm afraid it's the only way. All right, enough of this lovey-dovey stuff. We're out of here. Where did they go? Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, no. Sophie, 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 oh my gosh, I hope you're home, I need your help. Sophie! <laughs> Hold on, what are you doing? Oh my gosh, I'm sneaking around back. Why are you chasing Shady Steve? Hey, leave me alone! I'm gonna kick what is going on here? <laughs> I should have never broken in here. Oh, and stay out, Steve. Is everything okay? Oh, hey, girl, what's going on? Sophie, I desperately need your help. Blue Lightning turned himself over to villain Victor. <gasps> now that I'm thinking about it, that's why crime is increasing. No one's ever broken into my house before. I know, the whole town is in trouble. We have to do something. Attention, citizen. 
I don't remember putting this channel on. I have your hero trapped in a cage. And now that he's gone, I'm in charge. You're under my rule now. We have to go save Blue Lightning. And good thing is, I know where he is. And I know how to kick some villain butt. Let's go. So this is his base? Seriously? This is his base. This guy's gotta learn how to be a better villain. I know, Soph, but we have no time to waste. Come on, we need to break in. Unhand him. Nice of you to show up. Brittany, Sophie, you're here. You bet we are, dude, and we're here to save you. Now do what the nice lady says and open up the door, you villain. You think I'm taking orders from either one of you? It is my goal to take over all of Bloxburg. And once I do that, I will then make sure everyone, and I mean everyone, will bow down to me. And then after that, I will fill the lakes with plasma. Jeez Louise, I've had enough of this. Hi! Oh, hurry! You talk too much, dude. No time to free you, Blue Lightning. Come on, get out of there. Thank you, Brittany. That was dangerous. It was no problem. I mean, you've saved me a bunch of times. It's the least I can do. I'll never stop. I will destroy you, Brittany and Sophie, and Bloxburg. As long as Blue Lightning's in love with you, you will never be safe. Oh, about that. Um, Blue Lightning, I think we kind of work better as friends. Uh, I was thinking the same thing. That way, you'll be safe. But guys, um, what are we doing with this villain? Toss him in the cage. See if he likes it. And stay in there!